Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to English Football Club Barcelona, your Barcelona channel in English. Well, uh, today we have match Ma the derby up against Atlético, no, Real Deportivo Español, a club, as I told you yesterday, of Barcelona. So we are going to do the pre-match today. So without more delay, let's start. <laughs> Well, as I was as I was saying today at 9 p.m. in Spain, Espanol Barcelona in the stadium of uh, Real Sociedad, Real Club Deportivo Español. Sorry, no Real Sociedad. Sorry, Real Club Deportivo Español Stadium. No, that's the name of the stadium. If I don't remember, I don't have other name, but well, yeah, for those who are not from Spain, we call them Los Periquitos, okay, it's a name, it's a kind of bird, okay, so, well, I don't know exactly why, I, I'll be interesting someday to watch why, to read why, but well, this is the starting, well, not the squad, this is the squad list we have today, if you see, they have yellow t-shirt, exactly, it's not this one, but well, that's the, the yellow t-shirt they are going to use is the one that is for away the away kit of the europe the european team supposedly it's that's the order the purple is for the league the away league and the yellow is for the european competitions uh, away kit don't know why they use it now maybe because pff, i don't know to change a bit and not using all the time the same no? but well This is the starting of the squad, sorry, the squad list. We have Ter Stegen, Des Piquet, Araujo, Sergio Busquets, Ricky Puig, Dembele, etc. etc. You can read too, you know? Um, well, as you, as you can see, many of the players we had, except, well, some of them, for example, uh, we are going to have out. So we don't have Ansu Fati, who's injured, Memphis, who didn't get in yet. Sergio Roberto to Titis and Lenglet are still in, uh, injured. And then we'll recover, if you can see there, we are going to recover Eric Garcia. And also we are going to recover, uh, to get Abde and Jude Glanner, players who lightly, they have been helping us a lot. But I don't think today we are going to need them. Uh, I think Chavi is going to use other players, but first, before talking about the the lineup, I'd like to talk about what Chavi said yesterday. If you remember, I told you I'm going to talk about it today. No? So we he talked about many things. For example, he talked about Alves. He said that he's a very important player because we are going to miss him because he knows how to play in position way the, to mark players to give assistances. No? So we are going to, as he said, I'm reading perfectly. We are going to lose him for the following four matches. As far as I know, it's two. Well, uh, may, uh, I guess Xavi knows more than me. No, he talked to you about the improvement of the match of the team. It's true that we have improved a lot of things. No, uh, for example, against Atletico, we played like a team. We scored four goals. Think something that with Kuman we didn't have that goal. No, Kuman always said, well, we have to work about that. We have to work about that. But it seems that it never arrived until Xavi arrived. And then we have goals. No, uh, he talked also about the problems we still have. No, for example, uh, we ha he said that we have to keep with the results we've got, but uh, we have to, we've got, uh, we've got intensity, high pressure passes i don't know what he meant with that uh the, the sensations are good but uh like uh if sorry if the sensations are good then the results will come now as, as it's happening now but later than then is when he was asked about uh, uh playing for la liga no fighting for la liga and then As I said yesterday, it makes no sense that question because he's the man, uh, the, the coach, the manager of the team. And then he has to say, obviously, that we still fight for La Liga. Actually, yesterday, Madrid drew 0 0. They should have lost because actually, one of the things he, he was asked, it was about the referee now. He said that it's a very complicated job. We have to defend them, and and they they I guess they it's they always try to be judged. No, 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Fair, fair. They were not. That's what I wanted to say. Fair enough. Um, yes, sir. Uh, Real Madrid against uh, against uh, Villarreal. There was a very clear penalty that they didn't mark. They didn't whistle, and what they didn't indicated or whatever they didn't punish whatever and there was exactly a very similar play as Alves got the other day the red car if I'm not wrong it was Asensio hit the calf of the Villarreal's player and he didn't get any red car at all um maybe I didn't I didn't watch the, the images at all I watched just the pictures the, by the picture is the same okay but maybe, maybe the, the 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 intention it was different because I didn't see the ball. But the picture is exactly the same with different results. We expect that today our referee be more fair or fairer. And then many other things about Dembele. He said that well, he can help us. For me, he's another player more, etc. No, but well. This is the squad we are going to play today, and it seems that Xavi today is going to use finally that three forward, that that three player forward, or that three forward players that we talked about yesterday, Adama, Ferran, and Aubameyang. As far as I read, Adama, well, the other day you can see that it, it's like he has been playing for Barcelona all his life. Ferran is another great player from Barcelona, yes, uh, for Barcelona. Sorry, the, uh, he has had time for to adapt the most the one i have more doubt it was about Aubameyang. to be honest i read today that he's he's prepared that he seems to be the other day he, he had intensity etc against atletico madrid i lost I, I saw him a bit lost to be honest media are saying that he he played well blah, 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 for being the first match it's true that almost the score a goal that was like if the first if the first goal you touch, it's a goal, dude, bravo for you. But it was not the case. And in the media, they are saying that he seems to be adapted. I watched some training sessions and I like it. What I saw, I like it, to be honest. It was, I saw a uh, uh, young uh, with with implication, with goal, trying to 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 to, to be. To, to be protagonist, okay, to, to be a steering player. So I think he can he can be an important player for these days. Um, now to be in the lineup, personally, I put it. Let's see the lineup I put. Personally, I think he's going to use him, but um, I have my doubts really. This is starting eleven. I put uh, well the for the. I don't think Eric Garcia is going to play today. He just finished and uh, came back from an injury. It will be quite risky to start playing with him today. So I think it's going to be Pique and Araujo that are staying on the goal at the goal. Sorry, at the goal uh, as usual. Alba at the left, and then at the right, where I think it's going to be Mingueza. It could be um, Dest, but you will see now why. Not. Then in the midfield, I think it's going to be sacrifice. Is going to be Frankie De Jong. That's what I think. Even though he played the other day one of the best matches I've seen of the young this year, I think uh, Gabi is incredible. I think he, he he deserves all the minutes he's having the other day. He scored, etc. So I think he deserves to be today in this lineup. Uh, Pedri without counting and Busquets, well, you know. And then Adama Torre, Aubameyang, and Ferran Torres, as we were saying. Um, Aubameyang is going to be at the right. And that's why Dest is not going to be there. Because I think we need to cover that back. Raul de Tomas is a very dangerous player, a very good forward. Uh, and I think we have to cover that position. If Alba goes up, we have just three defenders. If Dest is there, we are going to have two. It's quite dangerous. And I think the one should be there. It's even though Xavi doesn't count on him much, really should be being anyway that's all for today hope you enjoyed the match really today because it's going to be a very interesting match thank you for everything and see you in the next video have a nice day